Hello everybody. We have decided to show you what we get for Chewy because strangely, even though it's Sunday, it was just delivered by FedEx. I know FedEx sometimes delivers things on Sunday, but I never thought they we'd get anything on Sunday. I thought it had to be things that were really, really special, like one day delivery or two day delivery from Amazon or something like that. But anyway, at least it's here. I'm going to have Don open it up for you. Open them all up for you and show what we get every month on Chewy. And no, we're not sponsored. We're not sponsored by anybody, and I don't think we ever will be. But I just thought you guys might be curious what Tug and the cats get every month, and the rats, and the fish. So that's one of their boxes of litter. And one of their bags of cat food. And here's the second box. You're not going to use the scissors I gave you? Yeah, bark at all them snowmobilers, Doug. <laughs> Tell them who's boss. Tell them it's the off our yard. Okay, this is Tug's dog food. The Just Six stuff. It's really good for him, better than what he was having eating before. And then in the third box, I look out and end up with more and uh, it's coming from him. Yeah, it looks like we're going to have to do this in a two-part thing because I don't think this is all the boxes. Nope, this is just more litter and more cat food. Yeah, and there's supposed to be another bag of dog food coming in. And, and uh, the rat treats and the fish food and the tugs treats. There's going to be another box. New cat litter scoop. Yeah, a new cat litter scoop, so maybe Monday. But this is the first three, three boxes anyway. There. Nobody's going hungry. So there's all kinds of icicles out here. Should probably knock them down, I suppose. there so the sun keeps trying to come out which is nice but the wind chill is minus below zero so that's not a lot of fun but back to like I said before winter wonderland with all the snow all over the trees that's pretty much the only pretty part about winter is when the snow gets all over the trees But Don said he was going to come out here and finish, finish plowing with his little, little tiny plow. And so he should be coming out soon. It was kind of nice out here. I think the storms are over now, finally. But Burr, it is cold out here, that's for sure. Whew. Really cold out here. But I thought I'd just bring you out here and give you a more up close taste of the snow. 
all I have on is a hoodie. So I'm freezing. So I guess I should go back in the house because burr. Do you like playing in the snow, Tug? You like it? Yay. Yes, you have to stay tied up because if not, you chase snowmobiles. That's not good. You don't want to chase snowmobiles. Remember a few days ago when I said this gigantic jar of pickles, 128 fluid ounces, one gallon, was going to last us a long time? Wrong. I just found out Don has been eating them just to eat them. And I have only gotten a half a pickles worth out of that so far. So, so much for that idea. So dinner tonight is a small baked potato and a chicken, a veggie chicken sandwich on a bun with turkey bacon on a wheat bun, a piece of cheese and some mustard. So dinner was really good. You liked it, right? Is that your dessert? Yeah. There's some, this. <laughs> a dessert. One of those is good and one of those is yucky. Yucky. Hey, it's rich and rare. Ugh. R and R. Yeah. Canadian. Yucky. I met a Canadian guy one time. And let me tell you what, he got into a scrap with somebody, fighting with him. You know, actual fist, fist fight. And before he even punched the guy, he said, I'm going to donkey punch your ass. Okay. Now, now everybody that was standing around watching the fight, you know, because in a way the guy, that guy's butt whooped, he, in a way he did deserve it, but it was just never heard anybody use the term of donkey punch. Yeah. It was funny. Everybody started laughing when he said it. I think I've heard that since then, but it's, I think it's more popular now than it probably would have been then. Yeah, probably. This was probably about 20 years ago. Yeah. So we are not watching the Super Bowl. We don't like sports. I used to watch the Puppy Bowl when I had cable many, many years ago, but that, that was it. And sometimes the halftime commercials are nice, are good, but I just find them on YouTube afterward rather than having to sit through the football, which I don't like football and neither does Don. And our live stream starts in about 45 minutes and I have a feeling it's there's probably not gonna be that much of a turnout because everybody's watching the Super Bowl, but that's all right. We'll be here for the people who don't like sports, like we don't like sports, right? <clears throat> sports, what's that? Yeah. I'd much rather play them than watch them. Yeah. Not our thing. Nope. So the live stream just ended. It's almost 10 o'clock now, and it went very well, again, and it's always fun to answer everybody's questions, so I want to thank everybody who came, and remember that next Sunday, 8 p.m. Eastern, we'll be back again. Don't threaten them like that. I'm not. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Don't threat to me. No. Yeah. Uh-huh, uh-huh, uh-huh. No. Tug, where are you? Come here, Tug. Oh, hi, White Storm. <laughs> where is Tug? Tug! Come on, Tug! Come on. Say hi to everybody before the end of the night. Got a yelp for you. Are you getting hard of hearing? <laughs> Kylo, Spotted Leaf, and Smokey on the chair, and everybody everywhere. You Tug clean hard of hearing. Yeah, either that or he was like, no, I don't want to go out there. Probably. Wait to it. No cheesy grins. <laughs> kitties. Kitties. Good kitties. So it's getting pretty late. So we're going to go ahead and say good night. And we hope you enjoyed the video. And that you like, subscribe, comment, share, and you're having a good night. Say good night. Say good morning. And we'll see you tomorrow.